good morning so i'm here in uh in uh my airstream this is a 1976 uh land yacht sovereign this thing's <clears throat> pretty sweet and this is this is where i stay when i'm out here in joshua tree um there's a house on this property as well but it's an airbnb and it's it's usually rented um anyway so i stay i stay here but uh yeah so last night i took the truck out to out to the dry lake bed and i was doing some some cool videos uh for this youtube that i'm trying to put together but of course i um i ran out of battery on my phone died right when i was <laughs> getting really nice sunset light but um anyway so we'll go out there again uh now in a minute here um had some some coffee ready to go more or less so let's check it out there she is waiting waiting to go waiting to go for a ride yeah this is the moon yacht the moon yacht joshua tree This is on 10 acres. That That's called Mount Shadow. It's also called Tilford Mountain. It's also called Amethyst Mountain. And it's also called Mona too. It goes by many names, but I don't know. Maybe Shadow Mountain is the coolest. Anyway, so yeah, let's, let's go out to the dry lake bed again. All right. Come on. Oh. Yeah. On there. So uh, I'm hooking up this Manx buggy to the truck. And the reason I'm doing that is because I'm going to take the truck. over to my I'm gonna take the truck over to my other property which on the other side of the valley I'm gonna leave it over there I just feel like it'll be safer sitting there while I'm gonna be gone down down uh, down by the coast for a few weeks um and I'm gonna bring this buggy because this is how I'm gonna drive back over here to get my get my other truck to go home with that's that's what I'm doing so yeah plus plus i want to take uh i want to take some pictures and videos of this of this manx buggy because i might i might put this thing up for sale even though this is like my original you know uh thing that i was super into but now i'm just kind of more into these trucks so i don't know probably should not sell it but i might Anyhow, uh, that's what I'm doing this morning. The buggy and the truck.
dune buggy back there towing like a dream well you don't even know it's back there it's so light Some good old boys back over there shooting on a beautiful Friday morning. God bless America. He's not behind us anymore, not towing it, and that's because uh, my plan got kind of derailed here um, when I was out on the dry lake. <laughs> right towards the end, I uh, stepped on the throttle a little too aggressively with the new buggy, and I broke the throttle cable. So, I had to tow that back to where I got it from back to the house over there and now I'm driving to the other side of the valley without the new buggy and um, my friend Mel is uh, gonna come pick me up and uh, take me back after I put this uh, put this Chevy away and get it parked where I want to park it put a, put a car cover on it
so it says. Here comes my ride. All right, Mel. Dude. Thank you. Just a fine day. It sure is. All right. We are styling. Well, that's a wrap, folks. Got the truck covered up and put away for the next couple of weeks. I was lucky enough to have my neighbor Mel come pick me up and his, what year is this bug? 67. 67 bug. It keeps running, so I'm going to keep driving it. Yeah, pretty cool. Or somebody said, what can I buy this better than this? Yeah. So, thank, thanks for watching this uh, uh, journey with this truck and and uh, my first uh, YouTube video, hopefully first of many or more. So as they say, uh, hit subscribe and hit like and all that stuff. And let's do some more uh, Some Gods YouTube uh, videos, all right? Thank you. Have a good one, y'all.